then this amount of uh, charge or light yields by nuclear recoil, which is lower than uh, light produced by electron of the same energy. So, uh, in these models, actually, well, we should okay go back to the uh, uh, our textbook that uh, for for calculation for calculation this uh, ratios between this uh, nuclear recoil uh, and uh, light or charge yields. So we can have the uh, approach, which uh, okay a very uh, okay at that moment is a uh, this this question of this light yield, um, which agree with the data very well. And then Clark theory established in the 1960s. And also, okay, uh, uh, well, uh, uh, it's quite well success for, for delivering this uh, uh, theories. And both of this uh, uh, approach in this one actually uh, is trying to get this quintry uh, uh, factor, which yes depends on the energy, as well as this starting power, which is DDR. And these are the models of uh, quintry factors. For link part, uh, which is quite okay uh, for, for ionization detectors, you can take this form, and uh, later we will see that it is quite well for for previous uh, data. And the first, first theory also explained this light yields uh, uh, quite well, in quite well uh, situation. But, uh, and uh, current one, that is the uh, quite, okay, uh, in 1960s, which is the semi uh, imperial theories. And uh, current one that uh, uh, built a more uh, powerful one to it, uh, it evaluate this starting uh, power, which is from the uh, simulation code, include the QED collection and the quantum uh, field theory corrections. So uh, there's a, a, a ES tar for electrons and trim or screen screen holes for ions. So has been built and uh, updated in current uh, years and. Uh, on the other hand, actually, this is not the only uh, models to approach these quintry factors, but uh, someone trying to get the other uh, approach, which is from the uh, uh, May, also uh, did a, a lot of survey on these quintry factors. So uh, from here, uh, we can compare with this environmental and cal calculate the quintry factor. So I should, okay, give you the precaution that this quintry factor actually depends on the impurity of crystal and materials, as well as the temperature, even the collective time of uh, simulating signals uh, have different uh, quintry factor value. So uh, here we, uh, uh, we adopt this uh, train simulation, and it seems quite well to fit with the data from the low energy to high energy. So, uh, here, and not uh, such, not such uh, okay, com uh, confidence at the low energy, which is okay, uh, less than uh, one kV uh, recoil energy. So uh, we can see that uh, this one okay, uh, complementary that uh, uh, people also attend for the other one that is also actually uh, I should say difference because this. Uh, already have a deviation from the experimental point of view. So, so difference from the previous one. So, but, but, but not too far difference. And uh, according to our domestic search, that uh, going to lower and lower threshold. So suppose we cannot tell this uh, quintuplicate at low energy. That means we cannot identify the, the, the mass and cross sections in, in domestic search. So uh, uh, telling this thing is <coughs> okay uh, crucial. So how do you generate the uh, You mean the trains code? No, experiment, experiment, expecting experiment. Uh, uh, okay. 
uh, experiment, uh, okay, uh, first of all, I'll get this uh, uh, monoenergical uh, neutron source, which may be come from the accelerator or some other uh, uh, particular source. And uh, we get the, the thing from the simulation, we get the single scatter and then get the, and we know the angle, and then we know the, the, the total energy deposit in the nuclear, and then the ratio of the observable and the uh, calculation energy and get the ratio. So, uh, not all of the uh, quantum factor was done by this way. Uh, some is using the uh, amazing source, but uh, that is be more questionable from the simulation because uh, that is energy dependence and uh, that is not easy to predict. So uh, not only that one, but I also see this uh, uh, quite, uh, okay, for us that is uh, interesting uh, crystals, like this model that uh, has been detected by King's and uh, Tools, which uh, okay, and which have the very okay uh, well fit with the models, and so the model that as we uh, heard from uh, Professor Wang that uh, the long standing Dharma collaboration has been adopted, and this liquid argon also be detected, and we can see that uh, they have a different approach from May and from Linkhart, and then here has been okay. We can see the difference from the link part and the other models. And then that uh, okay uh, tells the fail of this uh, link part predictions for the liquid outcomes. So not always success. And this one is the liquid uh, genomes measurements. And why uh, they have more points due to this um, material is the, the current, uh, the most sensitive uh, detectors uh, in the world. So uh, even uh, this, so far, uh, they use this uh, uh, measurement trying to push down this uh, uh, sub, uh, low energy region. So previous locks of uh, giving the strength bound for, for direct dynamic search was to use here here. And this stop here is due to the conservative choice. So they have no idea beyond this one. So okay, obviously they have this one is okay. Th uh, okay, it's so quite cheap to open the new detection windows. So but uh, getting this such low one is not such a simple. So this year that uh, okay they have a preliminary talk uh, results in the talk. So uh, we see that they, they do see trying to get the, the other two points here. Uh, at the uh, uh, three, 3 kVs. And meanwhile, this uh, uh, ionization yield can go to the kV region. And that is the, so far, is the most, uh, okay, this is the improvement for now uh, nuclear uh, recorder progression part at low energy. But that's only available for the S2, as we know that uh, they have a power when they combine together. But uh, they are not able to get this, uh, uh, 1 kV calibration for both uh, light yield and, and ionization yield yet. And then we know that the ionization yield is, uh, signal is bigger than the light yields uh, in principle. And that's one uh, affect the uh, future uh, projects as well. So here I mentioned the, the current uh, uh, future projects for Z900, they will upgrade to the one ton uh, soon. And LZ uh, is the combination of this uh, lux and uh, zephyr and uh, uh, Panda X, which is our neighbors uh, next to CZP and S mask uh, using the single uh, 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 light yields uh, detectors uh, with with signals. Oh, this is a future. This is a future. Uh, okay, pro project that they plan to have the five tons. And and where will it be? 
اتفاقات جو هم And the churning have the okay the okay here this name and uh, this incident ions actually uh, follow along with uh, symmetry axis and the plans for the particular mark, uh, uh, materials suffer the series of the small angle like this and then that maintenance uh, to open this channels that means it can penetrate much further and you lost the energy like the electronic coil, which did not okay, okay, uh, suffer from this recoil, recoil, nuclear recoils. Send us this, send, the, send this, to, send this to this fracking effect. That is the reductions of this flux of Ions, which originally from this uh, lattice spike. So that means, okay, uh, that's one actually is the case that uh, we are uh, trying to get because this, we are trying, uh, they are only saying that this the ions channeling effect. But uh, okay, considering this uh, channeling behavior was be studied in the 1970s, uh, for, okay, for three, uh, uh, okay, include this, okay, uh, last of this test uh, uh, of this channeling and rocking effects. So here is the, the, the typical one that uh, using this monotronic uh, oxygen beams. And then suppose these the random projections, we do see this too. <coughs> And suppose that uh, pass through the particular symmetry axis or the trends that, okay, you give a bound here, and which is not between. So we call the quench effect, uh, channeling effect that means the quench effect should be the one. So send us the, the, the energy lost by the electro, uh, electronic coil. So this one has the higher energy Okay, you need the uh, 24 MeV, and here is the 10 MeV. You can see that, that the channeling favor with the low energy, and that we know is because we have to keep this channeling in the one channel. It's better not to have a higher energy, otherwise you would have a, a higher probability to go out of this channel, uh, 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 tunnel. So, uh, for less, from this part that uh, currently that uh, we, we know, uh, there's a two main uh, theoretical tools from the simulation and from classical uh, analytic models. So um, that's one uh, we are not familiar with that. That uh, is giving this uh, impact parameter and scattered uh, angle by the uh, train and S trains simulation code and put it to this uh, okay, uh, more uh, complicated uh, crystal structures called uh, uh, Sibaco, uh, based on the, uh, in, based in uh, California. And this is a some of that actually is commercial available. And uh, also they approach this one from this an analytic models Okay, uh, based on this uh, link path theory. And uh, it was be proposed in direct search, uh, firstly by uh, Dharma uh, collaboration. And, uh, okay, uh, uh, recently that uh, Nomini groups also are studying on that part. So, what is that analytic model? So, actually, that uh, they found the, 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 the potentials. Uh, like the CD, uh, uh, empirical uh, theories, and that this uh, channel, channeling requires this uh, particular, first of all, uh, particular uh, the angle of the projection uh, part, uh, okay, uh, with this 
symmetry axis, and the other part is the the, 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 the critical radius, which related to the map, which related to the incident energy. So when it's test one, that they calculate from from gamma group that okay, we calculate with a very enhanced boost by at low energy part, which even okay close to one order of one quintile factor, which means that in fact the low and low energy part that is easier to give the to give the channel uh, channel the ion in in the crystals. And here is a sodium model that okay from simulation that uh, you see the red color left uh, was the code channel channel the channel and the, the other part is okay not not be channeled. So uh, we know that it depends on the energy. So this was the delivery by uh, gamma groups. And uh, recently, that Gilmanni uh, group uh, in US, uh, UCLA uh, trying to deliver this part with the same method of theory. And that they reproduce their, almost reproduce their results uh, for the sodium molydides. And but they point out the more important thing that uh, that channeling was being studied for the beam. That means most of that in the middle of this channel. However, that's one, what we call the channel is the recoil, a uh, nuclear recoil, which is inside this crystal. What is we call is the blocking effect. <coughs> and then that is, uh, okay, uh, easily to leave uh, a bright from the crystal um, uh, diagrams. So uh, they calculate this one best on this idea, and they get a very okay less uh, 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 quick fact uh, channel infraction with a less than uh, okay only a sodium uh, greater than one percent order of one percent is this in some particular energy only. And then it also depends on the temperature because of the bonus. Also, they calculate the semiconductors, uh, include the uh, silicon and geraniums. And we saw that uh, it's almost okay. Uh, uh, from the, from the, this is the uh, silicon and this is the germanium part. And okay, as we mentioned, that the germanium part, most of this, uh, okay, uh, working operation systems, this uh, uh, liquid, liquid argon temperature that is less than, less than, much less than 1% of this channel interaction. So go back to this formula that uh, we discussed it in the second page that uh, from the, from the uh, okay, uh, beginning that um, we are trying to get this cross section. However, we have the cross sections and the event rays with the nucleus, and it's not the nucleus. So uh, that's one actually this defect cross section this, okay would uh, decrease with the increase in momentum transfer, and while this uh, wave length is not longer no larger than this nuclear, nuclear radius. So for the uh, first grown approximation, which is just taking the, uh, the plane wave that uh, giving this form factor as this formula expressed by these formulas. And for the very classical models from nuclear, and that have sh the show models, okay, telling the different uh, atoms preferred. And then uh, here have the more linguistic charge density from the Fermi density. So taking this account into this part would affect the uh, direct search directly. So we can see that this uh, form factors as a function of this uh, charge uh, momentum parameters. And then um, we can see that they have a, okay, some approximate big Okay, and there's another big problem at, at the most of the big fraction. 
and this uh, this comes to the detect, uh, direct detection, as well as this detector response models also affect our measurements. Something like I'm going on this uh, very simple and very classical uh, part, which called the uh, uh, compass scattering from uh, ten Michelin perfections that uh, has been uh, established in the 1920s. And then, even that's one follows our, uh, okay, uh, make the challenge in our detection channel. So what is left? Because the cla classical part is last then due to this, uh, uh, this optical electron effects. And that's one actually we, we studied in the 1970s, from 1970s. And that's more modified compass gap scattering was the okay, expressed by this one, this this free electron test has the uh, incoherent uh, functions which related to the electron momentum and uh, uh, the the z z numbers of nuclear of atom. So this one actually uh, we we coming from this uh, uh, free electron and rest of the compass scattering. However, even uh, we have the uh, survey that's one black code bound compass scattering uh, for from this one. Actually, most of that agree with theory calculation for x functions. However, uh, this only happened for the larger momentum, electron momentum transfer. In the cannot, it starts to deviate at low energy. Well, we can see that this one within the particular gamma rays and with the tiny angles, and then it cannot stand anymore. So uh, it seems that that's, uh, okay, approximation theory meet the challenge and uh, border, border of this, uh, 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 that uh, well, we should test this uh, value to this uh, models. So actually, uh, uh, this Coming to this one, actually, uh, that's two body decays turning to that uh, three body decays uh, by this uh, uh, atomic electron effects. So uh, you would really does this effect and the low energy which we need today. So uh, that is pointing out this problems as well. So uh, besides the wind as the diameter and the uh, nuclear recoil as this uh, uh, golden channels to detect. Uh, actually, uh, the type E uh, uh, interaction is also available. Just due to this energy energy transfer in this uh, elastic nuclear recoil is extremely low. So this one is the number of capacities that uh, uh, particle from wind and this energy transfer would be order of the 1 EV, EV which is okay, uh, far away from the, the current uh, detection experiment limits. So uh, we know that this Q as the number of velocity might be the MV, and this V is the number of velocity velocity. So you think that, okay, detection this electron is not available and uh, not possible, but uh, actually, uh, okay, people was people, okay, identify this free leading elastic atomic process, calling this, uh, okay, uh, electron ionization and electron uh, excitation and molecular dissociation. That can be the candidates that, uh, okay, uh, uh, given the, the EV scales energy and still the detector would get the response. And the more earlier, okay, uh, uh, Western people, okay, consider this, suppose this optical electron momentum have, having the order of the MEV scales momentum, that will boost the transferred energy from the 1 EV even go to the KV region, which can be detected. So uh, we will see this uh, scale stop. GDB dark matter direct search via this kind scattering by by Z, uh, Z 10 So 
from the differential construction uh, of the event rate, sorry. Uh, we see that the um, they, they have the several uh, turns. One is from the velocity distribution, okay, both as well as this four factor. And the more important part for this electron uh, construction tend to this momentum distribution of particular uh, uh, materials. So next one is coming from the Zeylon ten. Uh, they have the ten, okay, one electron and two electron, three electron. Even nothing this energy, they give the exclusion product. And since the the four factor is not well known as well, so they give the okay uh, different four factors for for exclusion products. So it really starts to touch, and as we know, that there's no way to get the sub KeV, especially in less than uh, 100 GeV, uh, any, sorry, NeV regions. Uh, uh, and it really opened up the very widely uh, uh, detection channels by electron, uh, wind electron velocity scattering. So for the, for the Germanium part, that also uh, have this uh, idea that we can follow, but uh, since this uh, germanium detector will suffer this momentum distribution of this covalent electrons um, are unknown. So, and then this outer electron is the most sensitive and uh, easy ionized by uh, wind. So that would be lost a lot of portion, we guess. And then that, uh, once we say, uh, as Professor, as previous talk uh, mentioned, that we also can be the expanded uh, objects. That meaning uh, we also can have the magnetic moments. And th this group, this theory is, is trying to, okay, uh, figure out these perceptions and uh, trying to get the upper bound of the point space of magnetic moment versus this wind marks. And for the for the studio scanners that measure also the hot candidate due to the axion, and their formula actually was in July okay, in two thousand eight that okay this axion also can as the dark matter can have a signal in our detect detectors, so something like axion comes with this uh, company like and emit this dharmas or uh, the the. <coughs> Electric or this uh, critical uh, 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 interactions. And here we try to get this one from this uh, axial electron uh, channels and with this covering constant with the wind mass. And then the wind mass already turned to the several order of, different, order of uh, magnitude difference from this nuclear recoil that is going to the KV regions. And uh, here, okay, in this, okay, in a few months, that Zhejiang uh, Hangzhou, okay, released this uh, articles that they are doing this axion light dark matter uh, particle as the local dark matter. So, okay, same idea, but with this, uh, okay, furthermore, okay, polish that, okay, they, they, this axion is the relativistic axion. So actually, you see the similar one, but it shift with the mass scale. And also, people also uh, considering this uh, pseudo scalar particle can have the atomic ionization channels. So, and not the only one, but this, sorry, not a direct detection, but this uh, indirect part that can be detected by our detector uh, uh, as there's such a as solar heater photons. And okay, that may annihilate in the solar uh, uh, cells and uh, it will come, it will penetrate to the Earth and it would have the, okay, they create a heater photons that is like the, the neutrino oscillations.